this brand in this box is so underrated and it is going to be a very flower power unboxing so stay tuned hello my name is andrea welcome or welcome back to my channel most of my stuff is about handbags and accessories so if you like that kind of content then go s subscribe down below but thank you for joining me in the babe cave today and i am wearing a specific kind of color that's almost purplish <laughs> because of what is inside this tiny box and before I get into that box, uh, this was a sale item. It's kind of some colors and stuff that I'm not used to buying. I'm just giving you a hint. But, uh, and it's, as you could tell by the thumbnail, flowers and Kipling. So let's get right into this box. Just a tiny box because it's a not very big bag. <laughs> It's just in a clear plastic bag. This is a lightweight, amazing color <laughs> with a beautiful gray and purples and green background. I saw this on another channel, this print, and Kipling was having a sale. And here's the back side and I jumped on this. And the price of this bag was only $30. Look how cute this little gray monkey is. <laughs> it's the furry kind. And the name is Vincent. How cute. What do we think of this beautiful pattern? Yeah, I wore this shirt on purpose with my little scrunchie <laughs> and even my lips. Because I'm starting to get into purples a little bit, but this is kind of a mix of purples and pinks and gray. And uh, yeah, it has, oh, I forgot to tell you the name of it. It's called the Michaela Kissing Floral. Um, there it is. And it has, of course, the fabric nylon strap. And I like these adjustable ones. You just loosen it real easily to make it crossbody or a shoulder bag. And this is more for, you know, if you're going to a casual event or going to a park or going to some festival, this would be what I would carry. It's lightweight. These zippers on a Kipling, I don't know if you've had any, but completely amazing zippers. Here's the the zipper. If I can get it. I always like those rounded zipper pulls, but it's a double zip. And here's the interior of the front pocket. It's not going to fit a whole lot of things, but when you're doing events like that or festivals, do you need that much room for your wallet? Because that's what you're going to be getting out. It has one slip pocket here. It just has like a light, I guess, kind of gray interior. Again, I love the sound of their zippers. <laughs> but yeah, it's very uh, underrated. Uh, but these last a really long time. These Kiplings, this material. My mom loves Kipling. Like that's all she carries now is Kipling. <laughs> And I'm the one that usually finds the Kipling bags for her. So I wouldn't be surprised if she liked this one as well. But yeah, it was it was only $30. Uh, I'll try to link it down below. The strap's a little bit thinner, but this is a small crossbody bag. The length of the bag is 10. I don't know if you can see that. By the tallest is about seven and really the depth is we're just gonna find out together because I'll see if what fits inside this 
uh, with you. But look at, this is smaller than my other Kipling monkey. I'll show you my other Kipling bag that I have. This is my other Kipling bag of mine. Uh, the rest are my mom's. <laughs> and this is the Queenie backpack in jaded tonal green. And there, this is so perfect for amusement parks. If you need to carry hand wipes and hand sanitizer, any kind of refillable cups, they all fit in here. This one has one, two, three, and then the main zipper compartment. And then a zipper in here. The, these Kipling bags are very nice bags to have and very lightweight. This backpack strap is so comfortable to wear. I can't say enough, but I wanted to compare the monkeys now. Here's the two monkeys together. It's like the baby and the mama. So I guess if, depending on what size bag you get, you get a little smaller monkey that I can't get to turn around. Here we go. There we go. <laughs> so very cute. Love this backpack. Can't say enough about it, but let's get back to what fits in here. <laughs> so it has the front zip, which I assume I'm going to use it for my wallet since it'll be easier to get to. And so I just use my, one of my favorite SLGs from Coach with all of the colors, has even more colors on the back. So I thought that would be a good card case. And then I remembered <laughs> I had bought these round coin cases from Kipling. I think I got both of these secondhand, but this one is has all the colors, but no rubber on the back. And this one is like a magenta kind of pink, more muted than what it's kind of showing. So I was like, oh yeah, I have Kipling. <laughs> Kipling coins, so which one of these goes better? Probably this one. I think I'd just use this one. I like this one a lot. So you could still put your coins with your card in there. And then as a catch-all, which I don't have this filled, so I was gonna use this Longchamp little pouch, but it's, it's kind of poofy, so I don't know if I would use that but let's see what it what it does. Oh, you you can put the Kipling. I mean, it's gonna bulge out, but that's up to you. So for me, even though this is empty, I'll put this Kipling inside. <laughs> Fluff it up. Cause you want kind of a flatter pouch, you know, with your essentials, or you could just throw in your essentials. like. All I need is my keys, so that's that. We'll just pretend like these are my car keys. And then if you wanted to throw in some Band-Aids, you could do that. And a hand sanitizer, you could do that. It doesn't bulk out too much either. This is what it looks like. It can hold your essentials for a day out, you know, at a fall festival or a p amusement park or a party or a kid's party this is wipeable <laughs> so I don't feel bad if it does get stained but this is a wipeable material and I believe I can get it clean if little hands were to get on to on it but just look how pretty this is the print with the flowers just got me and the price <laughs> I really like the gray, uh, the gray plastic button in the front. Again, this is called the Michaela Kissing Floral. Really lightweight. Oh, I forgot my phone. So my phone can also, 15 Pro Max, I forgot to show you that. You can pop your phone in the back. It zips up just fine. It can hold all your essentials for sure. So let's try this on. So here it is as a shoulder. Here's the front. 
And then it's very easily to adjust to a crossbody. Super casual. What do we think of this print? And this is a good shirt to wear with it, right? So there it is, crossbody, and it still had room for more adjustments. So I'm loving this. Love the print. Super pretty. I'm gonna rock this whenever. I don't know. Do you think this is a specific season that I wear it? Nah. I could wear it now. <laughs> it wouldn't bother me at all. So anyway, if you noticed a little sweating, it's because I'm going through changes. <laughs> And uh, also, I am five months dye-free in my hair, so I'm taking you along this uh, journey to see what my silver streaks appear to be. <laughs> I just am kind of tired of coloring my hair, and I'm going to try to age gracefully. <laughs> so I want to grow all the gray streaks out. And where there's no color left and see what that's like and if I like it or if I don't I hope I do so have you all done this journey some of you I know have been through the hot flashes um, I've been taking a supplement that my doctor has recommended uh, it works a little bit but it also has um, some other good side effects it's called black cohosh it's a supplement, so that's what she suggested for the hot flashes for me. So I didn't know if you wanted that information, but uh, it also is actually improving my skin. And the appetite is not quite as strong as it usually is. I don't know if that's a normal side effect, but I hope so. I want to lose some weight. <laughs> So the big changes happening with me and my body and there'll probably be another procedure I'll talk about in the future that I'm going to go through. But anyway, it, I just want to age gracefully and I hope you enjoyed this video and this little bit of rambling of what's going on with me and uh, I, I just want to embrace who I am and who I've become and that's it and i love this bag <laughs> so i appreciate you all watching don't forget to hit the subscribe down below it's free and i hope i didn't scare you off <laughs> usually my subjects is handbags and accessories and some hauls lifestyle it's all rolled into one so subscribe down below and thank you for uh, joining me today in the babe cave and until next time, I will talk to you soon. Bye. I was going to use this Kipling. Er, don't forget, forget to hit the sub.